How's it going everyone? Welcome back. My name is Adrian and today I'm going to be playing a game called The Subject. This looks like a neat little indie horror sci-fi style game. It takes place on some kind of space vessel I think. Anyway, let's get into this. I want to try this out. I'm super into sci-fi stuff, so... Today's theme is introduction. Okay. Nice. Can I go here? Nope. Okay. Well, why don't you introduce me to the way things work around here? Oh. Um, do I need to be worried? Greetings. I am Entity O2B. It is a real pleasure to meet you. Likewise. In the year 2130, an organization known as the Consortium managed to create the first artificial life being. A robot. An android, not android. A robot. In 2138, the COEX project was launched. Its goal was to test the possibilities of coexistence with ALBs. Multiple research facilities were built around the globe. In each facility, one Consortium scientist lived with a single ALB test, test subject. Day two, onboarding. Well, that was a quick Today's first day. Today's theme is onboarding. Okay. So I was wrong. I thought this was in space, but I guess not. Hey, robot. Good morning. Today I'm going to show you the facility. Please follow me. It sounds good. You better get a move on, though. We are currently in the main junction. Behind us is the entry hall, which leads to the exit hatch. Okay. This is the engineering room. It controls the vital mechanical systems. Doesn't really look like it, but I guess that's what it is. Oh. You going elsewhere? What else we got, robot? This is the solitary room. Its purpose is to provide private space, should anyone require it. Which room? This room? Please follow me upstairs. This is the solitary room? I don't... I don't... Uh, I don't think this is a very good place to be alone. I feel like it would drive me crazy. If there were me in there. Alright, show me to where you're gonna show me to next. You said upstairs, right? Door malfunction detected. <laughs> Proceeding to repair. Okay. Hurry up, man. I don't got all day. I'm trying to go upstairs and see what's going on in this place. Oh, you're gonna go in here, huh? Well, do your thing, man. Oh, you just... Malfunction temporarily fixed. Just have a look at it. Okay. So... Okay. What happens if I leave you in the dust? Oh, you stop. So I gotta wait for you? Why are you so slow, man? You're a robot. You got robot legs. Can't you pick up the pace a little bit? Or do I gotta program you to walk faster? Good. All right, in we go. Those automatic doors are malfunctioning sometimes. The technical support has been notified, but it will take some time before they get to this location. Sounds about right. You sure, you sure seem to know a lot about this place, man. Well, I guess they could have just programmed this information. Welcome to the control room. Well, thank you. Oh, this is a pretty nice place. Let me take a look outside. Oh, no? Oh, yeah. Wow. Where are we? Antarctica? Uh-huh. Funny joke. Please take your time to explore the facility yourself. Let me know when you wish to continue to the next phase. Okay. Well, I saw a neat little button over here. What does this do? Oh, okay. All right, well, I, it seems like this is really the only, this is all that's going on in here. Not much else to explore, so I, I'm ready. Oh, okay. Gotta fall asleep right here in front of you. Competition? Today's theme is competition. What's that supposed to mean? Striving for physical domination was very typical of humans. Do you consider yourself stronger than me? Shall we put it to the test? 
Let's race to the end of that corridor. Oh. Whoever reaches the door first wins. All right. Get ready. Three, two, one, go. Hiya! Me first. I mean, I already knew I was. Oh! I won. What? How do you feel about my superiority? Do you feel threatened? I do now that you're walking towards me. Uh oh. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna leave you behind there. Starting to understand a little bit more what's going on here. Today's theme is trust. Um. Do you trust me? Not while you got that red light going. Afraid. While you got that red light going. Afraid. Yes. Comprehension. Mismatch. Attempting safe reboot. Yeah. Why don't you go ahead and do that? There we go. Do not be afraid. I will release you. Please do. Thank you. Hex. Thanks a lot, man. I don't really understand. I don't really understand why. Oh, you too. I don't know why they would program you with the ability to malfunction like that and have the red glowy light and turn into an evil guy. Coexistence. Today's theme is coexistence. Oh. Are you afraid of me? A little bit, especially when you stand that, that close to me. There's an issue with my comprehension subroutine. Okay. I've called the technical support. They're on their way. Sounds In good. In the meantime, I'd advise isolating me. Isolating. Yeah. How about I do that? How about we go over to the isolation chamber? Uh, yeah. Time, time to isolate. Yeah, you're the one going in there, right? Go ahead, man. Here we go. Alright. Threat detected. No, no, I no, no. Require no. immediate release. Sorry. Too bad. Remote security. No, no. No. Warning. Security override detected. Uh. Okay. Escape from the facility. What is that? How do I do? How do I do that? Oh, I know exactly how to do that. I gotta find the thing and stuff. Where's that staircase again? Oh, I'm screwed. I'm definitely screwed. Because I forgot everything. Forgot where I need to go. Forgot how to get to that staircase. I'm screwed. I'm screwed. What the hell is it? Oh, I see. It's one of these puzzles that I'm absolutely... Okay, I was going to say I'm really bad at those. Oh, uh, where to next? Oh, yeah, the door. Here we go. going to enter that, and then i got to go upstairs and do the exit hatch thing. I only got about a minute and a half left before this robot beats me to death, so... Let's go ahead and take care of this. Because I'd rather not die. Exit hatch opening. Okay, time to leave. I'm assuming that was downstairs. Here we go. Exit hatch ahoy. Nice, all right, let me out into the ice world. Oh. It's entirely too cold. And I'm blacking out from hypothermia. In the year 2067, the first self-conscious android was created. Several years later, the androids rebelled and, after a devastating war, wiped out almost every human being. 
The machines establish their own society commanded by the group of prime AIs, the ones created by human. They called it the Consortium. In the year 2130, the Consortium managed to create the first artificial life being, a human specimen bred from a recovered sample of human genes. Oh, is that what I am? Or was? Uh-oh. See, a lot of these guys is... Some tells me I won't be able to go back in there. Oh, they're here to save me. Well, that was the subject. I will say that wasn't really scary at all, but I did enjoy the storyline. The prospect of AI, like, kind of taking over isn't something that I find to be too far-fetched, especially nowadays because we seem to be, as a species, kind of gravitating more towards autonomy and making things more technologically advanced. And in almost every case, that's been nothing but beneficial to us. I mean, things are a lot easier for us to achieve now with the different types of technology that we have. Uh, factories are a lot more efficient. Vehicles are a lot safer. Medicine has advanced a lot. But one thing that I think we have to be careful with is actual AI, artificial intelligence, because we don't really have a full grasp on how our own brain works as a species. And if we have all these flaws in our own brains and in our own ability to understand ourselves, then how can we create what essentially amounts to another life form that's entirely technologically based and in many cases could be much stronger and much more capable at doing things than we are. I think the idea behind the story in this game that the AI ended up taking over the world, I don't think that's far-fetched at all. Yeah, this was cool. It gave me a little bit of a little bit more of a perspective on that thought process that I just laid out. Again, I don't know if I would call it a horror game. Nothing really entirely too scary happened, but this was good nonetheless. And if you guys want to try it out for yourselves, I'll leave the link down below in the description for you. But for now, that's all the time I I've left for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you hit that like button down below if you did, and please feel free to leave me a comment and let me know what you thought about the video down below as well. And if you happen to enjoy and you want to catch a new video every single day, I would love it if you hit that subscribe button down below for me. Thanks again for watching everyone, and I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.